Senate is voting right now on a bill that would kill the House of Members. More Capitol Hill ping pong. What a bringing Congressman Sean Duffy. He's on the Budget Committee. Uh, welcome to you, uh, Congressman. Tell me, what is your view about what is happening right now? Are you proud of the fact that the uh, renegade element, as some are calling it, the Republican Party, are leading uh, us all into a government shutdown? Well, a couple of things, Pierce. First, I want to I want to keep the government open. Uh, but we, uh, we've moved over the last week. We first had a defund uh, Obamacare bill. Uh, we then moved to a delay Obamacare bill. And tonight, uh, we voted just on one small section of Obamacare. We said, let's delay the individual mandate. The president already delayed the employer mandate. Let's just treat uh, big business the same as uh, our individuals in America. We did that simple thing. And then we said, well, let's have the administration join us in Obamacare. If they think the bill is so great, uh, we shouldn't just have uh, uh, congressmen and women in Obamacare. We should have the administration right, but, with us. But with the greatest, so, with so, the greatest so, respect, though, given that not only the president of the United States today has made it clear that he was re-elected and everyone had their chance then to, to make a determination about his key policy of Obamacare, but John Boehner said after that election was won by Barack Obama that it was a legal mandate from the electorate. That's why he got re-elected. And obviously you couldn't then just go against it. And then suddenly, well, apparently it's okay for you guys to just paralyze the government of the United States and make the whole world laugh at you. And I say to you again, do you take pride in what you guys are doing tonight? Because it is a ridiculous ridiculous state of affairs, isn't it? Beers, uh, we were elected in 2010 after Obamacare passed, and uh, John Boehner and House Republicans were elected again in 2012. But I want to go back to a point you made. Uh, this bill passed tonight uh, with bipartisan support. Nine Democrats joined us in passing this bill to send to the Senate, and some of the most conservative members, uh, Michelle Bachman, Steve King, Louis Gohmert, uh, they didn't vote for this. So this is kind of a middle part of the conference that passed this bill and sent it to the Senate because it's really reasonable. And listen, if the Senate is going to hold out and say, we're not willing to include uh, the president and his staff in Obamacare, or we're not willing to treat individuals in America fairly and equally, just the same as big businesses who storm the hill with money, going to the White House and, and congressman's office, and they got an exemption for that, that we're not going to treat individuals fairly just like big business? That's not right. I've got a poll and for so, you. I've got a poll for you, Congressman. 69 percent of Americans uh, believe that Republicans in Congress are acting like spoilt children. What is your reaction to that? Well, listen, I mean, I th some Americans might have disagreed with us trying to defund Obamacare. But tonight, Pierce, do you disagree that, that the administration shouldn't be in Obamacare? They think it's a great law. You have to agree they should be in with us. No, no, That's I one simple part. No, no, but then, what but then I also, believe, what do, you, I believe, do you think that, no, Pierce, but what but is worth, Congressman, what I believe is, of course there are issues with Obamacare. It's a massive program, and those issues should be explored and debated, and I'm sure it will be this, amended several times. However, the idea easy, though, that a small group of Republicans have decided to simply shut down the government over this no, is a shameful dereliction of your duty. That's not true. This is, this is a bipartisan bill tonight. Nine oh. Democrats joined us. Some of the most conservative members weren't with us. Again, I, listen, I want to be clear. I want to keep the government open. I no, want to keep don't. it operating. you don't. You want to shut it down. No, but I do. You don't well, but, want to keep it open. Listen, if you want to you keep saying, it open, you keep it open. I, no, but are you saying that Senate Democrats want to protect the administration not being in Obamacare? Or you don't want to treat individuals the same way you're treating big businesses? That's not who we are as Americans. Um, these are very simple, small reforms. I don't think reforms. you'll find that most Americans think you're right to us. shut down the government. Harry Reid could join us. And listen, this is very simple. It is very it's simple. A, you are right. shutting down the government with no, your no, no. antics. Bi listen, Pierce, bipartisanship tonight. And listen. Um, this is easy for the Senate. We're not asking for a defund. We're not even asking for a, de a complete delay of Obamacare. Well, actually, you have year. asked for a defund, and you've well, got nowhere. Tonight, you then no, asked for tonight. a delay, and you've got no. nowhere. But so you're still going to plow on, and you're going to so get today. the government shut down. And again, no, I say to you, if, President if, Obama if, was re-elected, so the people in America had their chance then to kick Bears. him out if they didn't like so his the key program. Bears. The House of Representatives was elected in 2010 because of Obamacare. And they were re-elected again in 2012. 
This is, I mean, this is what we're here to do is have a dialogue. And if the president is out golfing over the weekend, you even mentioned this, yeah. the president should engage. He should talk through this stuff. Will so you be, out of interest, guys, will you be, says, listen, will you be furloughing this, your, will you be furloughing your talk, salary? Let's talk with each other. Listen, remember in, his, remember in his State of the Union, he said, I'm willing to open my hand to our enemies if they'll unclench their fist. All right, let me ask he you one final question. Fist, we're extending our hand. Congressman, one, final, one final question, Congressman. Will you be yeah. furloughing your personal salary throughout this difficult period as uh, so many other people are having their salaries furloughed yes or no? I'm, on, I'm on legislation to uh, to uh, actually have all members of Congress furlough their their pay but my hope is still that we keep this government open so will you be I donating your Senate, salary will you be donating your salary Senate to charity does the right thing tonight Pierce and they keep the government open for a small simple change of including the administration and okay. Obamacare and, uh, and, but just and, to confirm, uh, you will be individuals. Just to confirm, you just will be the same. Just as to confirm, business. you will be. And if they do that, we don't have a shutdown. Congressman, just to confirm, you will be keeping your salary though through this period if no, the government well, shuts I, down. Uh, my hope is we don't have a shutdown. And I'm on a bill that would say, listen, all members shouldn't get their pay. Just like no right. budget, no pay. Keep the government open, no pay. I'm on that bill.